welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the month of april for the ophios the sun moon horizon sign i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back let's check out your may reading to see what is happening hi okay please let me know how you find these readings and we are going to be seeing what is coming up for the first week because this month is the week is the month of fire it is going to be good it's going to be positive um you're dealing with um the energy of uh, powerful energies coming in first week you have an air energy where you are on a new journey in your life and this is going to be good some of you could be starting your jobs in that sort of a situation or some of you could be moving wheel of fortune is here which you guys i think is the first one uh, in the weeks that is getting wheel of fortune so second week is going to be very good there's definitely a situation with an organization you could be of uh, being very 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 that people are seeing um that you're really really on the ball and you are right about certain things okay so this is um very good so you have hair fire and uh, hurt and water you guys and this is what i'm saying check out other readings check out your sagittarius readings but you of yours people are one of the luckiest people as the Sagittarians on this planet you're an healer you're totally different than the rest of these people on this planet okay most of yours people are not earl earthly and this is what i need to do a video over okay let's see um a new start wheel of fortune is coming in a new start and you are going to be very successful some of you could have been on a new journey starting something new in the month of may it is going to be very good second week whatever you need to do in the first week it is yes you have a beautiful energy of the energy of the devil in reverse so whatever lies and deception that you were dealing with with an organization or that sort of a thing yes it is over it is over because the truth is coming out yes it is over because the truth is coming out so whatever the situation whatever that was transpiring yes it's over because the truth is coming out energy of the lovers is here some of you were dealing with some one that was very deceptive it could be that that this person connect with you only for money and you're going to be finding this out this person wasn't being very honest this person came in your life he was sent by an organization but it's as if um the lies and the deceitfulness is going to end the outcomes of your month is that your financial your material world is going to be good some of you are going to be meeting someone who is a past life whether a soulmate or a twin flame definitely this is the um, soulmate and this is no this is a twin flame and this is the soulmate so it was like there was a block between you and your soulmate and twin flame and this is going to be released this block is that people know that you were meant to be with someone and they were blocking you and now it's going to be released okay someone something could be influencing the connection between you and your twin flame and soulmate it is going to be released because they're going to be coming in and you're going to be happy um nurturing the outcomes of the month for you guys is the energy of nurturing and the energy that whatever it is that you need in your materialistic uh, world it's going to be happening happening for you guys which is very very wonderful and very good but the most important thing is that people who wanted to get married could receive the message that maybe you are living with someone and the person wants to move the relationship to a higher ground yes you can receive um, the energy of marriage um, some of you are going to be seeing the truth of a situation with an organization that has transpired and there is going to be an healing coming in check out why is this doing this check out definitely um check out the energies so 
whatever is happening and transpiring I don't know but um, it is a beautiful layout that is coming in for you guys so let's let's look again what is happening the first week you have the energy of the hair sign there's definitely a new start a new journey is coming up for a lot of you new start new journey in your life you're moving forward and in a very very positive way and it's as if the universe is backing you and some of you are definitely if you're in a marriage or a twin flame relationship this is going to be good it's as if you both were meant to be in this relationship okay it's as if the universe is sending you to the right people at the right place at the right time marriages are going to be very good you're going to be financial stable so if you're married your marriage is going to be good you're going to be very very financial stable second week a very wonderful positive energies where um, some of you are going to be realigned or reconnect with your twin flame or soulmate and this 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 realignment is going to be good because it is going to bring you financial stability in your world in the third um, week you have the energy of the air fan now some of you in the third week is dealing with a situation with groups of people which is organization a can the hospital um, public places that sort of a situation um, it could be in the the, the shopping centers um, this sort of energy that is coming up now there was a deceptive situation that was plain there was some deception that someone was being blocked from a communication with someone else there could be that a network tried to block something that you were doing it can be that a company or organization tried to block something that you were doing and this block is going to be up Okay, this block is going to be lifted up. Um, in the third week, going in the fourth week, some truth about an organization is going to be coming out. Some truth, something deceptive, some lies and deceitfulness about an organization is going to be coming out. You are going to be finding inner strength to deal with it, and you're going to be having help from others coming in. I love these two cards together. And it's so weird that they, these two energies came up together is so powerful um, and this is why I start to do the readings on camera so you guys can see the energy of the cards because this is a beautiful deck but also you're seeing what is taking place and transpiring in these weeks as we go along always check out the on demand please find out other people who were born the 29th of November until the 17th of December because they are different they're not from this planet okay the energy that they come in to help people out on this planet you need to make sure that you find out and let them know about these readings that is coming out because it's as if there's certain information in this readings that will activate them and let them understand who they are and where they are on their journeys okay this is really um, a beautiful beautiful um, layout with the devil in reverse which is very wonderful because some of you have been dealing with some real deceptive situations and ex especially that there was an influence in the relationship between you and someone so um, some of you could have connected with a um, a twin flame or a soulmate or there could be a third party in a, a marriage that is going to be ending or some of you were connected with someone and there was some um, negative influence um, in the situation now um, that is going to be released the, the outcomes of your month is that basically what this is saying is that whatever that was blocking your your financial flow this is definitely definitely going to be ending so whatever and whoever um was sending you negative energies or working whatever because um now um i'm seeing more and more that people are letting me know that they are feeling the ends of negative energies from other people so whoever that was working these um 
horrible things because as far as I'm concerned if you are going to be um, using um, you know whatever you call it a witchcraft black magic or whatsoever you know go back to the bushes I that's not what it was meant to be it was meant for to use it to protect yourself and to, to remove all blockages and there is just some people I don't know because I can't imagine um, my family was never like that so we don't know that, that sort of a thing I just started studying different cultures and realizing um, the things that people will do uh, and another thing people stop eating from other people let people bring their shit to work don't eat it especially you ophiosis people do not eat from other people if you don't see the person making that food and they're going to be eating that food don't eat it because that is what messed up a lot of people are not aware sometimes you're at work oh I cook and I bring food for everyone why I didn't ask you you put some shit in there because you want you and I to be friends ladies and gentlemen stop eating from people go and get McDonald's okay only thing that McDonald's and I'm not giving McDonald's anything but stop eating from people okay I don't know that was a message for someone let's see what other messages is coming out this is a wonderful message um, this is partnership and alliance partnership and alliance so this is good obviously some of you are going to be partnered up with other people there's a healing that is coming in it's as if an end is a, is a stretched out to say I'm sorry um, for something um, some of you are receiving a hand of help that is coming up um, this is a very very good and some of you are going to be partnered up with people okay so you're moving on a new journey Woo! the hope comes up for the Sagittarians and it comes back up in the same position for you guys too so uh, oh 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 ladies and gentlemen oh my god you're having a reading as a Sagittarians look at these beautiful now look at this oh 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 there is hope and positive movement forward isn't this beautiful that's the eight of Pentacles positive movement all forward this is the energy of the eight of Pentacles it is about connecting with um, people at work for some of you connecting um, in new relationships um, reconnecting in new relationships healing marriages and old relationships it is going to be positive in your marriage and all relationship it is going to be a positive alignment of movement further and this is going to be good solitude is what we have here for you guys so a lot of you are going to be finding um, solitude within you're going to be finding inner peace um, and, and, and reconnecting with yourself okay in a piece and reconnecting with yourself is going to be very very positive because it's as if some of you are aligning with the right positive energies is as if you're connecting with the universal beams and guides um, and this is bringing out your spirituality so this is going to be powerful so a lot of you are going to be connecting with the right people or the right people to align you and open you up um, to the right energies going forward okay let's see what is coming up for the ophiosis um, animal spirit guide who is going to be helping you Ooh, um, the pelican spirit let um, let it shine and, and, and definitely definitely you can see this here happening let it shine ladies and gentlemen whatever is happening let it shine now the pelican spirit is a very very wonderful spirit that is coming in because the pel pelican spirit is giving you a new start um, um, in your world and this is going to be positive because whatever this new start and however this new start is you're going to be shining you're going to be opening up as a pelican you're going to be showing how beautiful you are when you open up and this is just going to be so wonderful and so positive so beautiful 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 energies um you guys have the cosmic heart and the affirmation is that i am the cosmic heart i am the cosmic heart so whatever is happening 
as I am the cosmic heart I am the cosmic heart now this is also a number nine energy um, and it says um, this card invites you to open up your heart fully and tune into the love radiation from Venus which is the heart center of the universe pure unconditional love is held within Venus at a ninth dimensional frequency and this is where I radiate that's why I can't take deceptive people liars and deceiving people because I radiate with an high energy vibration of love which is the ninth dimension frequency of love okay um, I did a video and I was talking about coming back to this planet and I said nothing ever will make me come back to this planet because Jesus um, people are so horrible on this planet and it is so true and it's because I, I vibrate with a ninth fifth dimension of love so I don't understand the hates the deceitfulness and the lies that people do against each other okay a higher frequency that we can currently access light workers have that higher frequency most light workers have the ninth dimensional love from Venus I carry that because I'm a 33-6. So, um, the angels are suggesting that you find time today to call on Mother Mary. So always call upon Mother Mary and her unicorns um, and ask them um, to help you to step down this powerful but gently love to a level that you can handle because not everyone can deal with night dimension unconditional love because you're just going to be just blowing your horns okay you're just going to be crying at everything and 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 you know giving away your life breathe in love from the cosmic heart and radiate it out to everyone you um cross so you know it's as if you're dealing with someone who's being very rude and that sort of a thing and just call up on the universe and call upon Mother Mary and the angel to place unconditional love over this person because obviously they could have been carrying negative energies and that is the reason why because I'm realizing how rude people can be so um, learn that the light worker invite invitation um, inv inauguration by fire so you guys have the inauguration by fire and why is that you're not from this planet if you were born November 29 until December 17 you are not from this planet I gotta do um, a video on that but it's not I, I will do like 15 minutes on YouTube but the rest you guys have to buy because you guys need to realize who you are duality is what you guys are going to be working with inauguration by fire now you are going to say and listen to this and listen to it over and over again and read again with it you're not supposed to do this three times behind each other okay you can do it every other day or once per week whatever you choose to do but it's an inauguration through my own free will, I choose to trust in the sacred fire to cleanse my soul and my mind and body. I have the spirit and power of the phoenix within me. My spirit will be triumphant, raising up out of the sacred divine fire. So I surrender my life into the holy fire of love, that which no longer serve me um, may be cleanse from my being and rapid growth of new life and flow through me may i be held in tenderness mercies and grace as i successfully pass through the inauguration by fire into the loving fearlessness power of my own divine nature may all beings through divine mercies be free to love so be it ladies and gentlemen I am wishing you a wonderful month whatever is going on I'm wishing you really really a wonderful month um, and understand that life is full of surprises but just um, roll with the punches namaste